Chris Godwin in the lineup. It's a false start on Cameron Brait, the tight end. False start. Offense, number 84. Five yards coming down. On that side with Evans, Godwin has not been hit, didn't play in the preseason, didn't get hit, drama started. But on the field, he left as good as ever. Deep drop here, and Brady fires in the middle. That's Evans to the 34 yard. Looks fabulous. They're raving about him in camp. Fournette with a lead blocker to the left. Fournette stays on. Worst a year ago. Fournette again to the left side. This time Dallas is as well. Luke Gottecki, he is the rookie in there along with Robert Hainsey. We need another 30 minutes, I think, to tell you about <laughs> all the different injuries and free agents. And we third and one out of the gun. Fournette runs to the right, and he will not get there to Marcus Lawrence. He is healthy, and that will be huge on that Dallas front. Marcus Lawrence, watch this play inside, just one on one against Shaq Mason, a very good run blocker but simply too quick. They have liked a lot here in camp in the backfield. And Brady throws it. <laughs> the payoff line game, right? Fournette, good space. Fournette down the 25-yard line. Third and five. Cowboys bring four. Brady outside. This is no easy task because Julio Jones is played the game against Tennessee the last preseason game one drive. Hands here to Leonard Ford. Just love to practice like a pro golfer hitting golf balls or something. Ford, see what he had. And he was getting emotional thinking about the window of the past and where he's going. Here's another great one he's got now. Julio. Last year in Tennessee. First down for the 47. They've been on the ground this drive. Second and seven. Cowboys bring some heat. And Brady complete to Julio Jones. Going to use Micah Parsons now as part of that five man line and just get him one on one. I'm not sure I would choose that guy. It looked like when he lined up against Tristan Wirfs. That's get the ball out of your hand quickly and neutralize somebody like Micah Parsons. Fournette again, pulled down. And Brady swings it out to Fournette. The Parsons, you know, we all think, man, it's amazing. This guy went from stand-up linebacker to outside edge rusher, and he straightened us up pretty quickly. He's like, hey, in high school, I started out as an edge rusher. They moved me to <laughs> linebacker, so I'm just going back to where I started. Defensive Rookie of the Year. Unanimous Defensive Rookie of the Year last year out of Penn State. Second in the Defensive Player of the Year voting as well. Third and two, Cowboys have come up with a few stops. Fournette on the edge, great block from Smith. Out around, you end up with one of your offensive linemen outside blocking a cornerback, and it's just... 15-yard line, Evans and Godwin to the bottom of the screen, and now the run for Rashad White. Is... Brady looking left, flag down, pass is caught. The... Godwin at the top. Third and five, Brady, Micah Parsons brings him down. Brady from the 10, low throw. From the 15-yard line, Brady off the spot, throws underneath. There's a catch by... That is fantastic. From the 29 with 30 seconds left, Brady takes an end zone shot. It... Third and 10, Brady gets rid of it high and... He... Make it exactly even as Fournette goes inside for a couple of yards to try to pull the ball away. Rashad White, the second back, is in. He's got the catch on the edge. Wells did start the playoff game against the Rams, but that's a big blow. And Fournette continues to run yards on the ground. Keep at it. Big opening Fournette into the second. It's as simple as football can get. Nice job in there by Rob. Jalen Darden has come in. He's in the slot on second and ten. Brady about to get hit. Got rid of light. And how many times have we... Watch Micah Parsons coming off the edge one more time. This time he's going up against the stud, Tristan Wirfs. One of the absolute best tackles in all of football. And yet his quickness and his power, Tom Brady knows where that guy is at all times. You can see him almost flinching away from him at the end of the throw. Third and three in this area of the field. Dallas has come up with big plays, and that's what's kept them close in this game. 
Brady throws, and it's caught by Evans. So big, there's just nothing you can really do about it. Arlington. Brady knows it's man coverage now. He shifted Fournette out. He's going to throw it. Yes, sir. Second and seven. He has to move off the spot, but completes it to Evans. Fournette went out in motion, came back. Leighton Bandrash went with him. He knew right now it's man up man coverage. And Brady will throw for it. Underneath intercepted. NBC Sports predictor app. Rodgers only 195 yards passing in the Packers' loss to Minnesota. Fournette. Of that big guy carrying the football, and good things are happening. This is just a mauling. I mean, there's. So that offensive front for Tom Brady, it's been familiar in his first couple of years in Tampa. As a matter of fact, if you think of the five protecting the treasure, if you will, they had as many starts together as anyone in the NFL. But Marpet and Jensen and Kappa, for different reasons, gone. Gedeke, the rookie. Hainsey, his first experience out of Notre Dame. And Shaq Mason. What he's going to do next year. Playing is a possibility. Broadcasting or even a year off is a possibility. So. Game. He just talked about his love of the game because it draws on every aspect of you as a person, your work ethic, your teammates. Tom craved that still. He wasn't done. Has come back for year 23. To share the field with guys like Micah Parsons. Trayvon Diggs.